Thanks for tuning in to Passport to the Palm Beaches, everybody. I'm Jack Journey. This is my friend, Lindsay Martinez. Hi. Oh my gosh, it's always a happy day whenever I see Lindsay. Thanks so much for coming on to Passport. Again, we had you a couple of seasons back. You gave us such a fantastic workout. We had to do it again, but today we're in one of the amazing parks in the Palm Beaches. Yeah. This is John Prince Park, over 700 acres. Mm -hmm. They've got fitness zones, golf, tennis, swimming, boating, I mean, pretty much everything. Yeah, for sure. So what do you got for us today? So today I have a burn five workout at our fitness zone area. They have zones here that are phenomenal. Just a whole bunch of exercise equipment put together that utilizes your body weight. Phenomenal, we'll talk about it when we get there. And it's covered, so it's beautiful. So you've got a little bit of the breeze, you don't have the direct sunshine on you, but you've got the breeze and the negative ions in the air. It's just fantastic. All right, let's get to it. Okay, so tell us about the Burn 5. How are you gonna to torture me? So the Burn 5 is just a series that I set up in here. It's 20 minutes to torch, <laughs> to torch your calories and to actually get that lean muscular look. It's wonderful in here. It takes 20 minutes, it's fast, and it's three rounds. Excellent, so what kind of results can people get if they do an exercise regime like this? Actually phenomenal. Number one, you're working out outside, which is always phenomenal, and Palm Beach County provides that everywhere. And number two, you're getting tremendous amounts of work for your muscles here more so than you would in a regular gym doing other things again because you're using your body weight so you should expect to start seeing a lean muscular body within the first couple of months so ideally how many times a week would you want someone to do the burn five in order to get the really fantastic results so i always want people to not overcommit because then you end up feeling like you're a failure and we have no room for failure in our lives. Everything is just great. So what you want to do is you want to get three times a week. Just commit to that. And if you get the fourth one in, that's perfect. All right, let's get to it. All right, step one. So step one, we always start off with your largest muscle groups. Those are your quads and your glutes. And I start with those because those are the basis for your metabolism. They're the largest muscle groups in your body. So when you utilize those, you get to maintain your weight. And in fact, it increases your metabolism so you can actually lose weight as well. So we work those twice. Okay, let's do it. So what you need to do is have your hands on your waist for balance and stability. And you can take a step forward, keeping your body perpendicular to the ground and drop it to 90 degrees and hold it there. Excellent. And then to the next one and hold it there. You're gonna feel the burn in the back leg, in your oh, yeah. quad, and your glute in the front, and right here, and then hold it there. This is number three. <laughs> You're doing great, <laughs> and hold it. Keep your chest up, excellent, and your head up. Four, and hold it. It's all in the hold, right? And the next one, five. Oh yeah, you feel that. Oh, absolutely. Because there's only five stations, I'm gonna get your entire body in this. So right now we're gonna work your shoulders, and your triceps, that's this area here that kind of gets loose as we age and this really, really tightens them. And you're gonna find when you put your hands here that you're gonna be able to push your body up. It's your own body weight. It's far, way more than you would do in the gym on your own with a free weight. Okay, you ready? Just push it out. Oh, wow, that's not easy. You're right, so we're Holy gonna do 10 of these. Uh-huh. Two, now you can feel it. Now, right here, can you feel how much that muscle's contracted? Three. That's excellent, right off the ground. That's a fantastic Four, workout. It's phenomenal, it's totally different. That's excellent. <laughs> <laughs> this is getting tired, it's hard, right? Let me tell you, I have not found this equipment anywhere but in the Palm Beach County area. This is spectacular. I've never even seen this equipment before before I worked here. This it's is a incredible. Great, this is a great workout. I tell you what, I play tennis three or four days a week. I have pretty strong arm muscles, but using the body weight, it's I'm, totally different. It's a completely different workout. This is really effective, I can tell it's you. Phenomenal. And it really does sculpt your body in a way that other traditional equipment can't do. Mm -hmm. You know, you would never be lifting this much weight. So you're doing 10 of the lunges and then 10 of these? Yes, 10 of everything, we do it three times. I better get cooking. Step three. This one's great. This is for your biceps right here and it's gonna get a little bit in your lats as the secondary muscles, and it's also gonna get your shoulders again, okay? So this is wonderful for creating some really cool definition here. Once again, so much harder because you're lifting your own body weight. Let's do it. I'm almost afraid to try. <laughs> I'm actually gonna have you switch your grip, okay? Let's make it a little harder for you. I'm gonna switch your grip here, and then go ahead and pull you I thought you liked down. me. <laughs> I do, I love you. But we're gonna give you a good workout. <laughs> okay. Ready, go. Excellent. I like that. It. Oh yeah, that, yeah, you can feel that working. It's excellent. Woo. We can see the little muscles popping through your shirt. It's Look at excellent. that. 
Yeah, and again, a piece of equipment that you will not find anywhere else but the Palm Beach County Area Parks. Okay, so station number four is all about your core, and a core is such an important muscle. They are the posing muscles to your back, and those need to be strengthened because then your back is carrying all the work. So this is great. Plus, it creates a nice aesthetic flat belly. So let's go ahead and cross your arms over here, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna come halfway up, okay? Good, and halfway down. Good, I'm gonna do 10 of those. Now note we're not going all the way down, just a little further down. Ooh. That really works your core. That's fantastic. What you can't see is the face that Jacqueline's making, so this is actually very difficult. Just that you're on an incline, because you're on that incline, it makes it a lot harder to come back up. It really does, Yeah. but this is why you have a six pack. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm sure you will too. So here we're back at your quads and your glutes again. Okay, but this is also gonna address your hamstring, which is the back of your leg. And this is a total leg workout, it's phenomenal. You're lifting your own body weight, but because in this instance where there's not weight, that's why we add the additional lunge walk. So you've got two things going here for the most important muscles in your body. So let's go ahead and push. You're gonna hang on here for stability, and you're gonna go ahead and push your body weight out. That's excellent, and bring it back in. Now, if you lift your toes, you'll uh -huh. get your caps in there as well. Just such a smart machine because it's getting everything. We just get 10 in here, and then we go right back to the beginning. You've done all five, congratulations, you're amazing. You're gonna go right back to the beginning and do all of these again for three reps. Got it. All right, we did the burn five, and now, here at John Prince Park, they also have this fantastic fitness path with all of these workout stations, which is really cool. They have this in a lot of the parks, actually, in Palm Beach County. What you're gonna do is gonna start off in a squatting position with your knees above your ankles and your booty sticking out, arms are behind you, reach it up, come down and assume the position. Then again, then again, and then again. Then walk around and go ahead. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> come on up. You're gonna feel that in your quads, you're gonna feel that in your glutes, a little bit of cardio, your heart rate's gonna go up. So what we do from here is we're gonna lunge walk in between each station, there's 10 of them, so you're gonna get a lunge walk and the next one we're gonna run and we're gonna alternate those. So you get a comprehensive workout. You're getting your cardio in and you're getting your strength and conditioning in. It's brilliant and you're outside in the beautiful sun. Who needs a gym membership when you live in the Palm Beach? Who? I don't know. All right, here with Lindsay again on the trail at our next torture device. <laughs> Quite a torture device. Okay, so this one's not gonna be so torturous, okay? What we're gonna do here is you're gonna hang from this bar. We're gonna get a little bit of a stretch to separate the vertebrae a little bit from the spine and really give your, your back a good stretch. So if you grab this bar right here and just let yourself hang, you're gonna feel the vertebrae kind of just move apart from one another and get a really good lower back and upper back stretch. Can you feel that? Yeah, that actually feels really good. Yeah, I'd say you do this for, if you can do it for 30 seconds to a minute and then come back down and do it a couple times. When you come back down, go down slowly because everything's got to go back on top of each other. So come down. And you feel the, the separation, right? I feel that it's really good. It's almost like a yoga stretch, only better yeah, because you've got your body weight. Exactly. So let's do one more of those. I take it back. I like this one. No more torture. <laughs> Excellent. Just totally relax. You can relax your body. It's really important to stretch, guys. It's really important to get your blood flowing back into every area. Good, now for yeah. the torture. Okay. <laughs> okay, so face me, uh -huh. grab the bars. Excellent, so this is for your core. This is an amazing way to get your lower core, which is really difficult to do for a lot of people. So all you're gonna do is you're gonna bring up your knees, okay, right up to hit my hand. Good, let's do that 10 times. Two, now when you feel, let's not touch the floor. Three, excellent. You want to challenge, and you can challenge yourself right in the outdoors. There's no payment for a gym. You're in that hot, beautiful weather. You're getting a sweat, so you're detoxing. And then you get to run in between and do a comprehensive workout once again by adding your cardio and your strength and your stretching and your conditioning all in one place. I can tell you, I'm not much of a gym person, but this I would do. You're absolutely right. I love being out here in the nature. It's so gorgeous here. We're right on the lake. People are so incredibly friendly. It's really an amazing workout. I highly recommend.